And the very first American Idol, Kelly Clarkson. With this year's American Idol narrowing down their top seven this weekend, and the Fox program's fans are wondering who will make it through. Families on vacation can also visit the American Idol experience as part of Disney's theme parks. It opened back in February, and it featured the biggest gathering of idols in one place. Not only did it feature the likes of Fantasia, David Cook, and Carrie Underwood, Ryan Seacrest and Paula Abdul were also present for the grand opening. Fans get there early and sign up to participate, and the park crowd then votes on the day's winner. That winner has a chance to be the next American Idol with a dream ticket, a front-of-the-line pass for regional auditions. Abdul talked about the American Idol experience. I mean, the day that the show would be on its eighth season and be partnering up with Disney to have an attraction is, I guess, it's, a, it's the nicest compliment, to be honest with you. David Cook, last year's winner, said he was just taking it all in. This is intense, man. I, I uh, you know, they kind of told me what was going on, and this obviously was a big deal coming in, but I couldn't have expected all this. So I'm, uh, I'm kind of in shock a little. Got to meet a lot of the, uh, the former idols that I get a chance to meet before, and um, I'm having a blast, man. It's fun. Underwood, Kimberly Locke, Fantasia, and Bucky Covington talk about the audition approach and the experience. Just do what you love, you know? If, if you love to sing and there's certain songs, whatever, just get out there and do what you love and show everybody how much you love it. That'll make everything about 30 times better. It'll be great. I was talking to some of the other idols earlier and I said, what a no-brainer, American Idol and Disney, family-oriented, children-driven, reaches across every demographic and age group possible. It just makes sense. It just allows the opportunity to, for people to sing, just for people who feel like I've gotten too old, I can't really go to the idol, but it allows everybody to be heard, and I think that's amazing. I needed to be heard, everybody that who walked down this carpet wanted to be heard, so I think it's, it's an honor to be a part of something so big. I went through it today, I went through the whole ropes, and it really is like going through American Idol. The, the little tryout room is the same, you got to come check it out, it is very, very realistic. At the kickoff concert, the highlights were Cook singing his hit Light On and later teaming up with Carrie Underwood for a version of Fleetwood Mac's hit Go Your Own Way. Another lonely day, another lonely.